Are you ready? Yeah. Big game coming up on Sunday. No game day is gonna be complete without the proper meal. I'm Dan Bailey, and today we're gonna to show you how to cook some chili on the big green egg. First thing we need to do is get the green egg up to a temperature of 350 degrees. We're gonna run through some things you need for the burger meat, and we're gonna start by cutting up one white onion and two jalapeno peppers. Next, we're gonna cut up some vegetables that we're going to add in later. We've got one poblano, four large bell peppers, two jalapeno, two white onions, and a few cloves of garlic. Now that we're done cutting up the vegetables, we're gonna head out and brown the meat. Make sure and grab your favorite chili spices, whatever that's gonna to be. Today we're gonna to use dark chili powder and lucifer. So we're gonna burn some of that fat off, drain it out with our one onion and two jalapenos. So we got the green egg fired up. We went ahead and preheated everything, preheated our pot here. So now we're gonna add all of our different ingredients. We got the meat. After that, we're gonna stir in vegetables and last but not least we got about a tablespoon of each of the spices spread over kind of evenly as we get all that added we're gonna pop the lid back on and let some of that fat cook up and cook off all right, we're gonna talk about preparing the sauce. For our sauce, we're gonna use three cans of diced tomatoes, three cans of tomato sauce, and three cans of kidney beans. Now you can either add or take away from that number depending on how you like your sauce. All right, before we take any of our sauce and put it on any heat, we wanna make sure that we can strain off some of that extra liquid. So we've got our diced tomatoes and our kidney beans right here, and we're gonna strain off that extra liquid, put it in a bowl, get it ready to go out on the chili. So we just strained all the diced tomatoes and the kidney beans. The meat is out browning on the grill. Once that's finished, we're gonna combine it all together. So something to keep in mind, this recipe is really for anyone. If you don't have a big green egg, don't worry about it. You can definitely still use your stove, your crock pot. All right, so we've got everything in there. Chili's cooking right now. It's important you probably want to stir it every 10 to 15 minutes just to prevent it from boiling. We don't want it to boil, we just want it to simmer. And then towards the end, you're going to pop that top off the lid and let it sit with the top off just so it can thicken up just a little bit and you get a nice hearty chili. And that's how you prepare Bill's classic chili. Enjoy the game, guys. Make sure you send us photos on Facebook and Instagram with the hashtag RURogue. Send us photos of those creations. Cheers.